I know one of my eyes are red right now, it's because I like poked myself in the eye with like an eye pencil. So that's why it's red, but I just really wanted to get this intro done. And oh, today I'm going to be doing my makeup collection as you can see by the title, wherever it's gonna be. And a lot of you guys, this was my like my most requested video. And I also said if I reach 1,500 subscribers, then I'll be doing this video. And since I reached 1,500 subscribers, which I'm so thankful for, I'm going to be doing my makeup collection. So I want to thank you guys so, 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 super much for getting me this far on YouTube. And it may not be a lot, but for me, I think it's a lot. 1,500 is a big number to me. So thank you guys so much for um, following me on my YouTube journey. You guys are the best. And also, I just have to have a disclaimer like all the beauty gurus do. They always have a disclaimer that they're saying that they're not trying to brag or whatever. And I'm obviously not trying to brag because... I don't have like as much as the super big beauty gurus do, but I might have more, I might have less, I'm not sure, but I don't have that much. But it has grown since my last makeup collection video, and if you want to see my last makeup collection video, then just click right here. And yeah, this makeup collection video, I don't know how many months ago I filmed it, but I have gotten a, more stuff since that, so if you want to see a before and after, then yeah, and the setup is a lot different. So yeah, I hope you guys enjoy this video and I love you guys so so much. Thank you for this wonderful YouTube journey I've been on. So let's get started with the makeup collection. So hi guys, it's um, me behind the screen and I just wanted to show you an overview on how my vanity look like. So these are my drawer, um, these are these cabinet thingies and they're like plastic and they're see-through and I really like how it looks and I'm pretty sure that ba Beauty Baby 44 did her makeup collection recently in her dorm tour or whatever and I'm pretty sure we have the same ones and I was like oh my god I have that one too but yeah I think we have the same one and I got also got mine from the container store so I pretty much set it up I organized it like eyes, face, and Oh, no, lips, eyes, lips, eyes, then face. So that's pretty much how I set it up. And, yep. So first, I'm going to start out on this side. And because there's like two parts, whatever. But I'm going to start on this side. And I have like a bunch of random skin and like um, hair stuff here. So the first thing I have in front is the CeraVe uh moisturizing lotion and I got this and it's really good moisturizing lotion because it's a non comedetic which means that it doesn't clog your pores and it does it doesn't cause acne then I have this not your mother's it's not really um it's not really a makeup collection this is gonna be like a vanity tour slash makeup collection so this is just on my vanity so I know this isn't makeup but whatever <laughs> So this is my Not Your Mother Kinky Moves Curl Defining Hair Cream. And this is just like a Japanese hairspray. Then I have a heat protectant. It's the Chi 44 Iron Guard. And yeah. Last but not the least, I have this hairspray. And it's just from Derm Organic. And it's a fast shaping hairspray. So yeah, now I'm going to get to the brushes I have. I obviously do not have like that much. And it's yeah and I don't have that much but it's okay and for and oh I have forgot to tell you I won like a bunch of this stuff from like a giveaway I entered like a long time ago and I honestly didn't think I would win I don't know how many times I entered I think I entered like once and it was the beauty by Carla giveaway and she's awesome I love all her videos and yeah so I have a lot of this stuff from the a lot of my elf stuff is from the giveaway so the first brush I have is the elf professional powder brush then I have a lot of these small eye brushes from a pack from Sephora. And this is an applicator that already came with something. And this didn't fit in the small containers. And this is the Wet n Wild color icon and it's an eye pencil. This is the e.l.f. blending eye brush. This is also a Sephora brush that I use powder to set my face makeup. I use this to um set my face makeup and this to set my under eye like yeah whatever and this also came in a this kind of broke off something as you can see but I just kept it I don't really use it that much and this is the elf um smudge brush where you like smudge your eyeliner or whatever to and to make it look less harsh and last but not the least this is my elf professional eyeshadow brush which is like a really good brush and all of these brushes are pretty good in my opinion and also what's on top of here is a cup cream cupcake it's called cupcake whipped lotion 
and it just looks like that and I'm not sure where it's from I'm pretty sure it's my sister's but it just looks like that and let's go see what's in my drawers okay so when you open up the first drawer this is what pretty much what you see it's really random it has like brands from like all different places and stuff so I'm just gonna get started on what I have and yeah, this is the Beauty Concepts. It came in, like, a pack of lip glosses, and I'm not sure where the other ones are, but um, this is from Sephora. This is a Wet n' Wild lipstick, and it's really creamy. This is a Maybelline Color Whisper in um, Heart of Attraction. This is a Maybelline Vivid, and this is in Vivid Rose, and it's a very bright color. This is, like, the only high-end stuff that I... High-end uh, makeup brand that I have. Like, the rest, pretty much. Yeah, the rest is drugstore. And... But I did order a bunch of stuff from Urban Decay recently because they have the biggest haul... haul oops, no. The biggest sale ever. Uh, I can't talk today. Sorry, guys. But they had the biggest sale ever, so I got, like, a bunch of stuff from there. And I'll do a haul when it comes, which is, like, later in the month. And this is the Bobbi Brown lip gloss, and it's... Yeah, this is the Bobbi Brown lip gloss. And this is a Tokidoki lip gloss. And I also got this for my giveaway. This is the e.l.f. lip um, hyper hyper shine gloss. And this is lives up to whatever. It is super, super shiny. So, And this is also came from the pack from Sephora. The Beauty Concepts pack. And then this is a Japanese lip balm. And yeah, it just says uh, moist color lip cream. <laughs> And this is a super old EOS lip balm that I had like since for the winter. And this is the purple one in and I got this from my friend. And last but not the least, I have the Stain Super Stay Stain Gloss. And this is by Maybelline. It stays on for a really long time. And that's just my first drawer. And this is all the things that go on the face or whatever. And I do not have that much. And this is a, a concealer that I had a long time ago. This is the Invisible, Invisible Concealer by CoverGirl. And this is a lot, a lot lighter than my skin. It was before the summer. So, yep. And this is a Maybelline Dream Fast BB Cream that's almost empty. So I got a refill of it right here. It's the, the same color. It's the Maybelline Dream Fast BB Cream. And it's in medium and deep sheer tint. And I started, I really like this Garnier BB cream. It's the Skin Renew to Combination to Oily Skin. And I have this Maybelline Fit Me concealer. And I also have the Maybelline Dream Bouncy Blush in Pink Frosting. Last but not the least, I used. I got this in my $20 makeup challenge and I still think it's really good. It's the NYC Smooth Skin Loose Face Powder. And the last place down here is the eyes i'm just gonna move that and this is the eyes and oh this is mostly mascaras and like pencils and primers and that kind of stuff that my eyeshadow is in a different place but yes so this is my elf liquid eyeliner so then i got this elf um brightening eyeliner pencil and I'm pretty sure I was wearing it today in the intro. And also, this is the e.l.f. Brightening Eyeliner Pencil. I think it's the, pretty much the same one. This is the color White and Wild color icon, and it does have uh, sparkles in it. This is the e.l.f. Eyelid Primer. This is the Maybelline Illegal Length Mascara. And I don't think it's that good, but it comes with... It's really cool. It comes with a mirror, if you can see that. And it just says uh, I can't really read that right now then this is the CoverGirl mascara the clump crusher and it's the mega protein wet and wild mascara then I got the elf oh I did not use this I never like use this it's just messed up but it's the elf lightening and defining mascara and last but not the least it's the NYC sky rise and this is actually pretty. Oh, yeah, good. this um, mirror is from the Container Store, and it's a really nice mirror. It this is the this is the zoom up one, and they also have like a regular one. So this is where it like zooms up five times bigger. And underneath that, there's like a palette, and I don't have a lot of palettes. So this is like the only one, but this is the palette that has what like so much stuff in it. And I'm I'm pretty sure I showed this in like a bunch of my um old older videos but it just has powders and blushes beautiful colored eyeshadow for like a lot of different looks more eyeshadows this is the bath and body works 
This is the Bath and Body Works body lotion. It's like a travel size. I have like random nail pastas here. This is the color show in Stocking Seas. This is a Sa Sally Hansen Salon manicure in Mermaid's Tail. I'm not sure why I have like two random nail pastas in here. It's really weird. Okay, so now this is all the things that are on top of the other cabinet and it's just a bunch of random perfume this is the um juicy couture body sorbet um which smells exactly like this juicy couture um uh perfume that i got as a gift and also on hillary duff perfume that i also got as a gift there are other um, perfumes and they don't really have any names they just came in like a random pack and they just look like that and they're really cute they're just really small and I also have this e.l.f. Um, makeup mist. And now let's get to the second area. So this area has like eyeshadows and um, Maybelline color tattoos and like for eyes and stuff. So when you open it up, you see a little something like this. Okay, so I have a lot. I have a few um, palettes and stuff. And this is a Wet n Wild palette and it's it says sweet as candy elf um flawless eyeshadow palette and i'm pretty sure this is in yeah this is in golden goddess elf i also have another elf eyeshadow that looks pretty similar and this is in beautiful brown the revlon um oops the price tags are still on it awkward but yeah i have the revlon cream shadow palette and this doesn't really have an oh it's called precious metal i have a sample of blue eyeshadow that from sephora three maybelline color tattoos because i really really like them i want to get more but this is the maybelline color tattoo in um bad oh tough as taupe tough as taupe then i have another 24 hour color tattoo metal and I think that's different because it says Metal by iStudio. And this is the Bailey Branded, the color tattoo in Bads of the Bronze. Then, like, the cabinet under that, it kind of has, like, a bunch of random stuff. And, yeah. Okay, let's just get started. And I have two e.l.f. Um, eyelashes. One in black and one in white. I also won this in the giveaway, but I didn't use it, as you can see, but it's the e.l.f. Natural Lash Kit, and these are supposed to look natural, I guess. Then I also have a sharpener, not just like a, any pencil sharpener, it's kind of messed up, but it's not, it's an eye pencil sharpener where you just, you know, sharpen your eye pencils. And last but not the least, um, here's this like random, really, really extra random stuff. And this is, I'm not really sure what this is, but it's from Lush. Then I also have another skincare item. It's the Ambi Fade Cream where it fades your dark spots. Then this is like from a long time ago. I should probably throw this away, but it's a dark spot corrector, another one. It's like pretty much empty. And last but not the least, I have a hand cream in there. So it's kind of messy down here, but... It's, I promise you, it's pretty much organized-ish. And this is, um, a, like, a travel container. It's from Costco where you could put your makeup items in here. And I also won this from the Beauty by Carla giveaway. And this is, like, a really cool thingy that it could pack a lot of your makeup in. and i also have this from this is like also from the beauty by carla giveaway and i'm so happy that i entered and um and i got these stuff and this is just an empty container that you could store your brushes in and this is just a random um candle thingy where you put a candle in it then down here i also have a curling wand and if you want like a tutorial of me doing it if you want and it's by bella beauty and it's a really good curling wand i used it like four times like a few times before and this is how the curling one looks like it's purple and the rest pretty much in here is like really random stuff like a pillow or a plastic case but this is also has something initially to do with makeup and this is a uh also another um container that you could store your makeup stuff in and this is from sephora this had like a bunch of brushes in it but i just took them out and this is also another container where you can put small things inside if you would like. And that's pretty much all. Can you